Hey, Soldier7 here. In this video, I want to talk about a certain type of games. Um, and I wanted to ask a question. It's about the, uh, the Riddick games, which you know, Riddick, the character based off the movies, you know, he had his own games and they were excellent. And, um, nevertheless, I wanted to ask a question and that is the topic of this video is, should Riddick have more games? And the reason why I ask is because, you know, I think that these games, just like um, in the previous video I did about Urban Chaos Riot Response, I think the Riddick games were kind of underrated themselves. They were kind of overlooked. I mean, it's not that they weren't popular, but they didn't seem to be as popular as other games that came out around that around the time. Mainly I'm referring to Chronicles of Riddick Escape from Butcher Bay and the Chronicles of Riddick Assault on Dark Athena. Um, these were these games were actually pretty great. Now I'm not the biggest sci-fi fan. Like that may come as a shock to some people. I mean it's not that I don't like sci-fi, but it's like when you talk like the ultimate sci-fi, like this kind of sci-fi, yeah, I'm not really big on it, but I do like the Riddick franchise. I like the movies, but the thing is, is I actually like the games better than the movies, and that's why I think Riddick should have more games. Um, if Vin Diesel gets to a point to where he's not able to continue doing Riddick movies, which he hasn't done and quite a while. I know there was the third Riddick movie, which, yeah, it was all right, but uh, I, I kind of like the, the previous two better, but nevertheless, that's not the point. This is about games, but uh, yeah, he, hopefully like he could always, you know, go back to doing games for Riddick, you know, because like I said, I actually think the games are better than the movies, especially the first one, uh, Chronicles of Riddick Escape from Butcher Bay. Um, that game uh, was was pretty awesome when I first played it. Um, it. It had a pretty good story to it, and and if you're a fan of the Riddick franchise, it kind of explains a little bit about his past. It doesn't explain everything, but like it kind of takes place before uh, the first movie, Pitch Black, and so does the other game, um, Assault on Dark Athena. They technically both take place before the movie Pitch Black. Um, but, uh, yeah, Chronicles of Riddick Escape from Butcher Bay um, was definitely the better one. Although the one thing I will give Assault on Dark Athena was the multiplayer. The multi They had multiplayer in it, and it was, for, it was fucking, fucking amazing. I was like, uh, like, I literally never lost, almost, for the most part. Like, I would lose every now and then, but for the most part, I would never lose an online match. Like, they even had these cool types of online games, these multiplayer games where you can actually play as Riddick and hunt everybody down and whoever killed you, you got to play Riddick next. But the best one I thought was uh, Butcher Bay Riot where you played as the guards, the prisoners, and the mercs. And, you know, I thought that was the best of all of them. But I don't want to go into too much, but yeah, I just want to ask a question. If you're a Riddick fan, do you think Riddick should have more games? I know some may automatically say yes, but then again, there's a chance some of you may say no. I say yes, because like, actually, because I think I prefer Riddick games more than Riddick movies. Yes, I would like to see another Riddick movie, because like, when it comes to Vin Diesel movies, I know he's big on Fast and Furious and everything and, st and stuff like that, and that's okay, but I actually prefer the Riddick movies. I just think they're better. I just think they're better in general. They got better, better storyline, more interesting characters, and so forth. But yeah, I just uh, want to ask that. So uh, yeah, should Riddick have more games? If so, please do tell. The comment sections are open. I personally think so. Um, I'm not going to go into full detail, but yeah. Go look up these games if you never played them. Totally worth it. Great games. Amazing. But uh, yeah, that's all I'm just going to say for right now. So yeah, Soldier 7, take care.